All right, guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Mumble app. So let's say you tried to use the online version, the, the web-based version, it didn't work, it's no problem, use the Mumble app. You can go to mumble.info slash downloads and download the appropriate version, either Windows or Mac. Now, if you're downloading the Mac version, it's going to give you a whole pile of security warnings. Here's why. A Mac is a computer for basically scared grandmas. Mumble is an advanced audio software for professional video gamers. So Mumble is going to be a more advanced software than what anybody uses on a Mac pretty much ever. So it's going to give you some security warnings. That's fine. Just say yes to everything. And, and, and if that's not working, we have a special Mac guide to help you guys install the pro-level Mumble software on the grandma-level Mac computer. So let's say you've installed it and you're running it. All right, here's how you actually get to Vora method on Mumble. So first, you're going to go over here and click this globe-looking thing, right? Click that. You're going to get something that says Mumble Server Connect. You're going to add a new. Uh, first, your username. Your username is going to be your first name and last name, like this. Or just your first name and last initial. I'm going to put the whole thing, obviously. Now, here's the other part for the address. The address is voramethod.mumble.com. And then you click OK. That'll get you into Mumble, and then we'll follow everything else as usual. It's just that simple. If you want, you can go through the audio wizard, or you can honestly just use the defaults. And we'll talk about those specific defaults in another video to help you really tweak this and make sure it works the way that you want it to.